Let's have a look at the privacy extensions. Like I told you, regular Slack with the EUI64 addresses uses the interface MAC address. This should be theoretically globally unique, but the host could be trackable around the globe using this bit of the IP address. There are two solutions to this. One, we can use a randomized interface identifier instead of the MAC address. This is defined in RFC 4941 and it is supported by some DHCP v6 implementations. We have with this option privacy benefits, but corporate management is more complex because you cannot track, you cannot troubleshoot that good, you cannot do logging because if you do a reload on your web page, you might have another address. So it's not the same. Uh, so for the firewall, it might not be the same session anymore. It's not that nice. And solution B, that's better, and it's also data. You can see that from the higher RFC number. Solution B is called stable privacy addresses, and it's defined in RFC 7217. The address is still not related to the MAC address, so it's not hardware based, but it only changes if your network is changed. So if you change from your corporate network to a hotel Wi-Fi in China, then you have a new address and nobody can track you. But if you stay in your corporate network, you will always have the same address. This feature is usable for the link local and the unique local and also the global scope. This is the best option, solution B.